Good morning. A polygon is a closed figure made up of line segments that do not cross each other. So I want you guys to really focus on this. It's made up of line segments that do not cross each other. And another thing that I guess they forgot to say is that they need to be straight lines. So curvy lines do not make a polygon. Okay? So for example, if I were to do this um, shape right here, it would be considered a polygon. None of the shapes, none of the line, they're all line segments and they do not cross each other and it's a closed figure. So something like this is not a polygon because it is an open figure. Um, when we focus on the, the shape right here, that is the Pentagon in Washington DC. And the Pentagon is also the name of a shape and really um, polygons are only two-dimensional shapes. They're not 3D shapes, okay? So the, pen, uh, the, bin, the building, the Pentagon, technically is not a polygon because it's a 3D building. However, when we look at it from like an aerial view, we can realize that it looks just like a, the shape the uh, Pentagon, right? And Penta, like I put in our schedule, Penta means five because it has five sides. Um, hexa means six, octa means eight, and poly means just many sides, okay? So when we look at that, we know that the fi uh, this figure has five sides. Do they ever cross each other? No, they don't cross each other, so this figure is a polygon. A regular polygon, so now once we know if it's a polygon or, or not a polygon, we need to actually focus on regular and irregular. Regular means that all of the sides on that shape are the same length, okay? So each side would have to be the same length for it to be a regular polygon. So for example, right here, that's a polygon. It's a regular polygon. This one right here is an irregular polygon because the sides are different lengths, as you guys can tell, okay? This triangle I think it's also, it's not a, a equilateral, so it is an irregular um, polygon. So regular means that the sides have the same um, length. And congruent, they're equal in length, and congruent angles have the same degree measure. So, That basically just explained this whole thing. So a regular polygon has congruent sides and congruent angles, meaning same size um, lines and same angles. Um, so we need to look at this. All right, does this uh, right here appear to be a regular or not? A regular polygon or not a regular polygon? So the top and bottom, they appear to be regular, right? Although these two appear to be actually maybe longer than the other sides, right? This seems to be a little bit longer, so I would put right here longer than the other sides. And are all six sides of the polygon congruent? So no, all of six sides are not congruent because not all of them are the same. So they're not. So it is not a regular polygon, okay? When you turn your page to uh, page 904, in this table, you're supposed to look at each one of the polygons, realize, uh, look at the, in a triangle, here we have an equilateral triangle and just another triangle that is not um, regular. So both of them have three sides and we could um, draw another polygon that does not have, um, that is not regular, and I could just maybe draw an isosceles triangle, right? A quadrilateral, um, so quadri means four sides, so this square is regular, this um, rhombus is not because the angles right here and right here are not the same. So they have four sides, and now I need to draw a different polygon that is not regular. So go ahead and draw it yourself. I'm going to draw maybe Here. 
Oops, I need to close it or it's not a polygon. Penta, we've already talked about it. Penta means five. So they have five sides. This one, all of them are kind of like the same. And I'm going to draw a polygon that has five sides. Oops. I meant to make it straight. If they're curvy lines, it's not a polygon. Hexa means six. And you draw a six-sided uh, figure. Two, three, four, five, six. And octa means eight. Oh, I drew the same one, which I'm not supposed to do that. So here we go. I'm going to start again. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eh, not really. So you guys need to give it some thought. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. There we go. Eight. All right. On the guided practice, guys, and I need you to really be doing it along with me. So, what polygon is this? We need to count the sides. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So, that means it's called an octagon, right? Because we already decided that eight sides, they're called octagon. So, it has eight sides. The sides appear to be the same, right? Or congruent and Geometry, we use this word, congruent, which means equal. So therefore, it is a regular octagon. And after that, I need you guys to just work on your independent practice pages 905 and 906. And please, I want you to really pay attention to the fact that you need to tell me if it is a regular or not regular polygon, okay? So you're gonna name the polygon and you need to refer back. So for example, if I were to draw this, well, that would be a triangle. And would it be regular or not regular? I would say not regular. And why is that? Because these sides actually are longer than this one, so that it's not a regular. So for each one of them, you need to actually give me um, two things in your answers. You need to give me the, the name of the polygon, depending on the number of sides it has, and if it's regular or not regular. And after you're done, please send me a picture of pages 905 and 906. Make sure that it is a good picture, guys, or I cannot read some of the things that you've written. Okay, thanks.